Hello and welcome on in everybody. This is Glamour Fairy coming at you with a brand new YouTube video. How is everybody doing today? Um, today, uh, it's actually the next day after um, the last episode I did, but uh, this is going to be posted a different day. Um, I believe I'm posting this on Thursday. Um, still, wanted to let you know. Um, so yeah, uh, yesterday we finished the second house plot, um, and Puddles is moving in, or P Puddles might actually already be in now, um, and then we're going to work today on Norma's, uh, hopefully it's Norma's, uh, plot, and maybe doing something else, we'll see, we'll see, um, but yes, let's, let's get on in this. Uh, hello everyone, this is Tom Nook, it's 5.03pm, this happy Tuesday, September 28th, 2021. Now for today's news, Faye Isle gained a new neighbor today, Puddles. If you happen to see her, please give her a warm welcome. That's all for me. Time for you all to get out and enjoy your day. Yes, yes. Okay. Um, so Puddles has moved in. We'll go ahead and say hi to Puddles. Um, also, I realized that yesterday I didn't actually say hi to any of my villagers. I think I said hi to Mo, and that was it. I didn't say hi to Sheldon, and I didn't say hi to Ursula, and I feel horrible for doing that. Um, here I am saying I want to get all of this stuff going with my villagers, and I didn't even say hello to them. Um, so we're gonna start off with saying hello to them, um, because that is absolutely rude of me. Uh, they're not even in their house. It's okay. Oh, there's Sheldon. <gasps> He's in his little raincoat. Oh, look at him. He's so cute. Hey, Glam, have a minute. Check it out. Somewhere around Jumping Jack 6074, I get the sense of total clarity and purpose, and I had an idea. You met Puddles, right? The one that just moved here? Well, if we get enough hyper-athletes like that to move here, we could start our own karate team. You know, or just have a bunch of cool workout buddies to hang out with. Either way, or either way, cardio. So, my idea was to stick their creations around, then we can attract some first-round neighboring talent. I pitched this to Ursula, and we both agreed. It should be you who throws out the inaugural first decoration. Alright, let's, let's see what the first decoration is. A utility pole! That's actually not that bad of a decoration. I've been given some pretty weird things as the first decoration that they give you. Um, so, having a utility pole, that's not too out of the box. You know, it seems like it would actually be a... Um, like in a in an island or not an island but a town hey uh, is it weight training time uh been into any cool fitness training programs lately uh no <laughs> i see i guess you have more um sit down hobbies yes that's that's what i do <laughs> maybe we can get together for some ice skating sometime you'd have fun oh that's so sweet <gasps> Little ice skating. Oh, that would be so much fun. Okay, let's say hi to Ursula. Sup, Glam? We haven't spoken in a while. Glad you stopped by. I miss talking to you. You're such an awesome listener. We're gonna talk to her one more time. Uh, looks like Gulliver's zonked out. Oh, Gulliver's here? I went over to wake him up, but all I got was a few seconds of sleep talk before he was out again. Think you can do better? I bet he's still down on the beach. Is he right over here? He must be either on the other beach or oh, let's go. Let's go see. I didn't even realize that Gulliver was here today. And she said Gulliver, so I prefer helping Gulliver because I like the pirate stuff, but I get it. That's probably another salmon. You know what? I'm going to get it. Um, I don't think I need it for the um, museum but it's great for money it's salmon season and I've been trying to get a king salmon on my other save so it's been uh, it's been a ride okay let's say hi to Mo before we say hi to puddles um. Ooh, Mo's... Wow, I actually like the setup. This is usually not what I see with the setup, I think. Or maybe it is. I'm just kind of... 
Check me out, I'm doing stuff. What are you doing? I'm making me a stone table. One of the bugs on the floor whispered the DIY instructions in my ear while I was sleeping last night. So I gotta build it before I forget what it even is. Check it out, plans for a stone table. I can teach you if you want. Yeah, teach me. Leave it to me. I got it all scribbled down right here, so just read this. If I can make it, then I bet you could do it in no time. He's so cute. Okay, wait, I want to talk to him. Uh, what's the latest? Have you talked to the new person who moved here today? I'm going to talk with them loot. W loots. Wow. I'm going to talk with them lots. I'm going to talk to them until they're sick of me and we'll be bestest friends. Off I go. Um. Mo, you're not, you're not leaving. You're, okay. That's fine. I believe in you. <laughs> okay, so let's go actually meet Puddles. This is the first time I've ever had Puddles on my island. So this will be interesting. Ooh, I kind of like the, um, the look of the house. Oh, that's cute. Oh, I forgot. <laughs> I was like, what is that stuff up there? Look at all that stuff up there at the top. I forgot that I put that up there when I was trying to grab the mums. Oh, that's funny. Hi, you're from around here? I just moved to the island. I'm Puddles and I'm totes not used to random folks just, you know, walking into my house. Oh, you're Glam? What a fab name. Nice to meet you, Glam. This place is a train wreck right now, but when I'm done, it'll be so adorable as you'll faint. So be ready for that. Maybe bring a pillow or something to land on? Later's Glam. She's so cute. Oh, I'm so ready. I'm so excited. I wish they had some of the stuff already in their house that we, like, built. Alright. So. Our goal today is to finish this one up so we can get normal on the island tomorrow. <clears throat> okay. Interior items. A uh, wooden simple bed, a wooden chair, and a classic pitcher. Wooden simple bed... Oh, I already forgot what they are. Wooden simple bed, wooden chair, and classic picture. Okay. Oop. Wow, okay. Um, simple bed and the chair. So just wood and, oh wow, that needs 18 wood. Oh my goodness. Okay, so that and then the classic picture, which just has clay. Let's grab those. Let's go grab the clay real quick. Do I have, um... Oh. Let's learn this. Cool. Alright. Let's go... I'm not playing this game a whole lot outside of, um, recording. Um... Because the most time that I find is when I'm recording. So we tend to, I tend to just. Hmm. I tend to just play this game when I'm uh, recording currently. Oh, we have denim pants. And we have the skirt. Um, I don't think anything that we have goes with. And I think it's our socks that I'm having an issue with. Is because our socks are black and white striped. So. I think that's what my issue is with this outfit. I love the top, but. I don't know. I just can't wait till we get Abel. Mabel. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no. Oh, no. I'm going to go out there and she's not going to want to talk to me right now. Oh, man. I pushed that button way too fast. I was just so focused on getting these done. It's okay. Um, keep crafting. 
and then we got the chair and then the bed all right oh let's see what's in here oh nothing's in here today okay let's see if ursula will just do it back to us again i feel so bad no, she won't. Oh, I feel so bad. Oh, no. All right. Okay. Um, let's submit our items. And then let's check out the exterior real quick. Um, the log garden lounge, the log stool, and a water pump. Okay. Garden lounge, stool, water pump. Garden lounge. Ooh. Stool. I'm going to need at least one more hardwood. And then the water pump. Which is another thing of clay. Okay. All right. Oh, oh, that's not what I wanted. That's okay. Okay. She was probably going to give me a reaction, too. That's all right. In time. We'll probably also get, um... We'll take care of Gulliver today, too, because taking care of this house is going to be a little faster than it was the last time. Last time we had some set... Oh, sorry, Sheldon. Some setbacks, so... It was a little bit difficult to get those things done. Oh, that is a centipede. Not a single piece of iron. That's so gross. Sorry, I don't like centipedes at all. They're, they kind of gross me out. I'm not a bug person either, quite honestly. Ooh, maybe I can get that dragonfly now that it's over here. I didn't realize it was going to come over here. Oh. Ugh. Oh my gosh, that was close. I almost did not get that. Mm -hmm. All right. Let's uh let's hit some of these trees here. Oh, see, I literally just need the one hardwood. We're going to hit a couple more trees. So it's kind of like what we did with the stone. Um, I'll probably hit the other stone that's around here. Um, it's probably a good idea to get a little bit more of the wood because we are running a little low. And since it's very beginner game, we're going to want as much of this as we need. Or can get, I mean... Let's get this butterfly here. There's quite a few uh, bugs. I want to get these into the museum real quick. Some of these, I don't remember if I've sent them to the museum yet. Um, it says that I haven't, according to my... Because it, it says uh, yes. Like, when it does say that, that means I haven't caught it yet. So... All right, that should be good enough for the trees for now. Just gonna pick 
pick all these up real quick. Um, and then we'll go ahead and craft the things that we need to craft. Oh, see, I did get one over here. Sorry, Ursula. I'm I am just being an absolute bully to her today. I am so sorry. I did not mean to do that. Okay, let's go here. And we're gonna take care of the ones that we um do need to donate. <laughs> Uh, make a donation. Okay. The monarch, the centipede, and the yellow butterfly. I'm fine. Alright. Let's go craft these real quick. Um, the three things that we need to craft. We'll put them out in front of her house. Um, and then we'll go into... Um, I think that signifies a cutscene. I think he says something about the campsite. I know the camp. I, I don't know if that happens today or the next day. Um, but we are very close to getting the campsite, which means that our um, smug villager will come in soon as well. Who do you guys think will be our... Because I believe it's a smug villager that comes in. Who do you think will be our smug villager? And last but not least, the lounge. Yay. All right. We still need to find Gulliver, so we'll probably do that next, after all of this is done. Um, I do want to check what I got from Nook Mouse, Um So I saw that that was a thing. Oh, we got two up here. Oh, catch five bugs. Perfect. Um, and then chop wood. Awesome. The other thing that will... Ooh, sell shells. Okay, I'll grab some shells on my way around. This will be easy because I think I wanted to unlock something. And then this will probably earn bells by selling items. Oh, yeah. We'll definitely get that. Um, with all the bugs that I've been catching. Okay. We're going to put the... Oh. The water pump on this side. And then we'll put the lounge right here like that oh this is not the right direction I wanted it um, that's all right we'll go like this oops Wanted it right next to the house. And then we're actually gonna turn this to its side and I'm gonna put the the stool right behind it. Oops. Perfect. Like they're sitting on it to use the the pump. Alright. Uh check the exterior items. Perfect. Wait, this means. All the home and furnishing prep work is done. All right, so I'm guessing... Oh, sweet. I got a thing for decorating outside. They should add this. They should add more to this. They only have 10 things on here, but they should have added more on here. So that way there was like, you know, 25 or 50 items and like... Because they keep telling you to keep putting more and more items outside, so... I think I'm gonna put the utility pole right here though, since I have it. It's a good spot to put it here. And I'll turn it like that. It's actually kind of a eyesore a little bit for our very uh, small island area. <laughs> um, but that's all right. Uh, 
we do need to talk to Nook, but I kind of want to wait a little bit. So we're going to go sell our stuff that we need to sell and see what... <gasps> they have the fortune telling set and the chem... Oh, and they have like the scientific set too. <gasps> okay, I want to sell. Okay, we're keeping those. Um, we liked those and I liked that. Um, okay, so we're selling the salmon and the cricket, the dragonfly and the butterfly. The rest of that stuff can go into my money system. Um, oh, wow. That's it? Okay. Oof. Here, I was like, oh, that's easy. Okay. We are definitely grabbing one of those. I kind of want to grab another one and give it to Ursula, almost. Because I want one for myself. Okay. It's only a thousand. Oh, oh, sh nope. Okay. Now, that being said, let's see how much this is. Six thousand. Okay, I could definitely get that, but I think I might have to pass on that. And then the freezer is thirty-five hundred. I kind of want to get it, but I also kind of don't. Um, I also haven't looked in here quite often as I probably should. Um, hmm. I am kind of liking some of these. Okay, I might buy those later. Um. And I might buy the other things here later. But I also need to keep some money. Um, I'm not... I haven't been doing a whole lot of money-making things lately. And I kind of need to uh, save some of my money for um, upgrading my house a little bit. Um, I'm not trying to, like, hurry it up or, or anything. But it is in the back of my mind. I also haven't been watering those at all. Okay. One of the things I need to do is sell shells. Um, I also need to, you know what, let's, let, let's go talk to Nook real quick. Let's go talk to him. Oh, wait, we talked to the Nooklings. Do you think it's, it's not sold yet? Okay. I think we actually have to go in here and have like a full on loading screen. I think that's what it is. Talking to the Nooks does like nothing. The Nooklings. Ah, Glam. Hello, hello. How have things been going since we last spoke? Are you close to finishing the plots and furniture? Everything's finished. Goodness, really. Thank you so much for all your hard work. Now to hurry with the rest of the construction and welcome any of the residents who have homes. And that's that, my friend. You have finished everything I asked of you. Ah, let me give you a token of my appreciation as promised. Yes, yes, this is for you. <gasps> Fencing! Oh, yay! You could surround your home to create a yard or surround some flowers to make a garden. Fencing should make it easier for you to create yards or parks or other outdoor areas. Positive this will lead to some interesting new landscaping scenes here on Lin by Isle. I'm thinking 50 pieces of simple wooden fencing should give you an excellent start. In the future, I'll offer DIY fencing recipes you can get by redeeming Nook Miles. The selection will change daily and will offer a variety of designs. Check the Nook stop sometime. Well, I couldn't have done this without you, Glam. That's for certain. That's awesome. Okay, so we won't do... We're not doing the campsite today, which is totally okay. Um, I'd rather it take its time. So in a couple of episodes, we'll have another villager uh, move in that is a smug villager. So that'll be neat. Um, okay, let's redeem some Nook Miles. Um, I have to do at least 500 is what it said. Um, I am looking at some of these things. Um, I don't really want... Ooh, oh, we already got... We already got fences in here! Hello? Okay, so it said only 500. Okay, but this... This is pretty cute. The bandanas are also really cute. Hmm. 
You know what? Let's, um... Let's grab one of these. I know I'm going to want them at some point. Um, and I do need to spend at least a 500 to get this... To get more Nook Miles, which sounds so silly to me. You have to spend Nook Miles to get Nook Miles. Um, okay. Uh, no, I do not. There it is. All right. Um, let's go look for, um, Gulliver then. And take care of that. Oop, I didn't want the that. There we go. Um, I kind of have a love hate thing with Gulliver. Um, I don't mind him. Um, but at the same time, he's also kind of annoying. <laughs> it takes forever to wake him up, and then like you have to either go fishing or go diving for his stuff, or you have to, um. You have to go diving, or you have to go digging for his stuff, which isn't too bad. It's just a little, like, ugh. It's a lot. Wow, you are way over here, Gulliver. Jeez. I thought for a second there that he was on the other side. Look at that. He's on the, on the farthest edge over here. Way anchor. Check his blood pressure. Who's your provider? Sorry, fellas. I already licked all these cookies. Had a test. For raisins. No, you walk the plank. <laughs> Ahab! Oh my god. Uh, wait, did somebody put salt in this water? <laughs> Some of these things that he says... Okay, I'm just... Some of the things he says is really funny. So, like, I get it. No, don't make me go back to space. It's cold and dark and... Huh? I'm not? In space? Whew. Good old terra firma. <laughs> oh. Alright. I'm just skipping all of his all of his jibber jabber right now. I just would like to uh Yes, I'll look for your stuff for you. Um, after you're done finding these pieces for Gulliver, there is almost always a rusted part, um, one of these pieces, and it's a rusted one in, oh. Um, let's drop that. Oh, I didn't want to bury it. That's okay. <laughs> I'll find it later. <laughs> um, oops. Anyway, there's a russet part that goes into the lost and found the next day. And when you do that, there's a recipe. I believe it's the robot hero that you can get. That is, um, that asks for like 20 russet parts. So it's always good to to get these pieces. Um, also, um, helping Gulliver gets the golden shovel. Um, I had to look up how to get the golden shovel because I was curious. Um, and in this one, you have to help Gulliver, I think, 50 times. Um, so I have not gotten any. I've only gotten the golden watering can. And I think somebody gave me the golden fishing rod. Oh, that's all five. Wow, that was fast. Gulliver, Mr. Sir. I got your pieces. I got them right here. Oh, that's them. Those are definitely my communicator parts. Um, I remember in Wild... I think it was Wild World. Where you had to guess where he was supposed to be going. And if you guessed it right he would send a piece from that place. Um, and if you guess it wrong, he would give you something else. And I can't remember what it was. Uh, 
Okay. I'm gonna actually dig this up since, you know, I kind of messed up there. Um, and I'm going to, because I meant to just drop it. Um, we're gonna go sell all of this and see how much money we get, because I would like to get the 5,000. Oh, wow. I found, like, three of our fossils. Oh. Oh, jeez. Padfoot, are you okay? Padfoot, hi. Are you saying hello to everybody? Are you saying hello to everybody? He missed his footing and he uh, slipped a little bit, but he's okay. He's just a little hungry is all. Um, Padfoot, did we get Norma? <gasps> we got Norma. We got Norma's spot. Bye, Padfoot. Yay, we finally got Norma. Norma's by the beach, so that is totally okay. Ooh, might as well grab these. Oh, that one's a different one than I have. Okay, cool. Um, we just gotta go ahead and do this. We'll go ahead and sell our stuff to the nooklings. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and sell these. Is that everything? Oh, wow. Okay, I still need to do that. Okay. <laughs> Alright, so yay, we got our 5,000. Wow. I had three fish, and that one I had, like, a bunch of sh shells, and I sold more doing the shells than I did um, the bugs. Shells are where it's at, man. All right. Look at that. We were productive. To oh. <gasps> Ooh, we got more. <gasps> oh, I forgot that this was a thing, that you could get um, nook miles for selling shells. Well, I gotta do that more often. They gave me money and nook miles? Dang. All right. Well, that was a very productive day. Um, let's learn these DIYs real quick and find out what our message in a bottle is. Um, to whomever this may be, whilst ma taking a much needed hot bath, my mind dreamed up the most fabulous idea for a DIY recipe. I'm compelled to share my recipe, so I have stuffed it in this bottle. Please bring this recipe to life. Best wishes. Um, I think that's... Okay, the name... I want to say Mael, but I'm not sure if it might be... <gasps> oh, a tall garden rock! Okay, this sounds really weird, but I like decorating with the rocks. Especially for, like more cottagey core kind of you know the outside core out ones um i've been kind of looking into some like kind of what i've been wanting to do and i did kind of like the idea of like norm core um which is the weirdest thing to even think of norm core is a thing because it's just normal life um but i also kind of like the idea of doing like some city stuff so it's really exciting. Um. Oh, yay! Ursula talked to us! Oh, I felt so bad earlier. Yo, so Sheldon told you about rolling out the welcome wagon and stuff, right? Well, I went and got something, too. Do you think you could find a spot for it? Absolutely. What'd you get me? I, n I know that you know where a drinking fountain ought to go. Oh, perfect. Now get out there. You got this. Literally and figuratively. She's so cute. Okay, but honestly, a drinking fountain right here. Oh, I was going to give her the fortune telling set. Place item. Perfect. Boop. Yay. Okay, um, I was going to keep the piano bench. Mm. Okay, I'm thinking about giving the piano bench to Sheldon and then the mobile to... Oh, wait, I can't give any... I can't give anything to Mo yet. Okay, let's give Ursula this gift. 
Um, this is for you. Um, a fortune telling set. Whoa, 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 a fortune telling set. Seriously, Glenn, you knew exactly what to get me. I'm gonna need to clean up a little before I show this off. It'll look so, so rad. While we're at it, here's a little something for me. It's a foot, a football. You know what? Screw giving Sheldon the piano bench. We're gonna give the sh Sheldon the football. Is it legitimately just like straight up a football? Oh my God, it is. Yep, we're giving this to Sheldon. He's the jock. It makes the most sense to give it to him. Sheldon, where'd you go? Sh Hello, Sheldon. Yo, cardio, you seem hyped as always. Here's a gift. Um, a football. A football, seriously? You've been working those kindness muscles, haven't you? I can't wait to show this off. I was always looking for an excuse to move my stuff around, so this really is perfect. All right, sweet. Yay! All right, with that, y'all, I think that is the end of today's episode. Um, yeah, we did quite a bit today. We got Norma. We're going to get Norma on our island. Finally, Norma is going to be on here. Um, she was one of the first villagers we even saw, and it's taken us so long to actually get her on the island. I'm so excited. Um, next episode, we will probably be seeing us building the campsite, um, and then we'll be soon seeing our next villager. I'm so excited. And then, it's, since it's going to be a campsite villager, we know it's going to be a smug villager. So, what do y'all think? Who do you think will be a smug villager? Who will be our smug villager? Um, I really appreciate y'all for being here. Thanks for hanging out and um, seeing all the stuff that we've been doing. Um, I will see you guys next time and please have a good night. Okay, love you. Bye!